Hello Sagittarius, this is your X reading for the 17th through the 23rd, Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. If you're new, welcome. Please hit the like button, share the video, and subscribe. Let's see what your relationship was like before. Mm -hmm. Guys are very drawn in, to each other as well as protective of each other. I feel like you both really kind of defended your relationship a lot, maybe even to others. Um, but there is definitely a very strong connection uh, to each other, I feel. You guys felt very happy while you were together. Very. Okay, we have Gemini energy present here. That is your opposite sign. So let's see how you guys actually view the relationship. Hmm. You felt like the sky was the limit, I do feel. That you can make it happen, that y'all can work it out regardless. We have zero and one here. This is the beginning. Um, this was something uh, I feel like that was very refreshing. Maybe even new to you. This connection with this person. Um, huh. I think you guys did a lot together. You like, I think just about every place one of you went, the other one was there too. And you guys were like in it to win it, I feel. Very much so. Let's see what your current situation is like. Hmm. I think you're kind of looking, thinking about what you can do. I think what you can say to mend things here. Now, this may be the other person. This may be actually a Gemini energy here. And um, so the lines may be reversed here, guys. So just take the message how it resonates and you guys can choose a side. But I'm going to speak from, excuse me, from Sagittarius point of view. Okay. So if this is not actually you, then you'll know it. And, you know, this line probably will be yours. Okay. But um, there's somebody trying to figure out here, what can they say? What can they do to fix the situation here? Somebody's really trying to make some ish happen, you guys, okay? So whether you or the other person, but I'm speaking from your point of view, okay? So let's see how the other person viewed the relationship. Hmm. They felt like, again, like the sky was the limit that you guys were going places that um, you were going together. They felt like this relationship was going to be a successful one. You guys did whatever you needed to do to make each other happy is what I'm getting here. Very Gemini, maybe Cancer energy present here. Let's see. Let's see what your perception of your ex is. Um, I think the thing is, I feel like they took a lot of like action based on whatever you did. It's like they follow your lead, but usually they're not really that what do you call it that spontaneous um they're not one to really take the initiative they really do like to study things before they actually jump into it so they're really not like the fool and just be like okay well i want to do this i'm gonna go do it so they're one to like really plan out and strategize what it is that they that they really want to do and i think as you guys kind of progress into the relationship that you know their true nature kind of come through came through and um and you realize that maybe they're just not on the same speed with you okay maybe they're not as mature as you are even you know maybe they are younger okay maybe they did like to like travel and go and do things but it's like it really had to be planned out to the T and you were just like let's go you know let's let's say we're going here and we're just gonna go 
let's see what their perception of you was or is. Hmm. And guys are kind of feeling the same way. They feel like you worked a lot. They feel like, you know, that was your focal point. That you worked a lot. Maybe you worked too much. Okay. Not really paying a whole lot of attention to them. Maybe you worked so you guys could go. You know, maybe you worked so you guys could travel across the world or, or whatever adventures you guys went on. I don't know. Let's see what their feelings, your feelings are about getting back together here. I think you do want to. I think you feel like. Um, you know, that would be a good thing for both of you because, you know, you guys were good together. I think you were like, like really good together here. And so I think you do want to, um, you want to work on this thing. I think it's a go for you. So maybe the other person is holding it up. Let's see how they feel about getting back together. They feel like it's a burden. They feel like. You know, it'll be the same thing again that, you know, most of your focus is on work. Most of your focus is on other things other than them, you know, and that's bothersome to them. Hmm. Let's see what you can do to move this thing along. Wow. I feel like for you guys to move this thing along, my Sagittarius friends, you need to walk away from this. You need to take your energy from this because obviously the other person feels like you're still invested. And sometimes when you are so focused on someone, they can feel it. But they also can feel when you're not. Okay. So, yeah. Take your energy away from this situation. Focus on something else. If it is work that you do to like take your mind off of things, then um, you know focus on your work. Focus on traveling by yourself. Even you know just go and do things. Okay. Let's see what they can do to bring this thing back together. They need to fight for it. They need to fight for it. They need to be willing to carry this burden and work on this with you. They need to work with you. That's what they need to do. They need to fight for it. Don't give up on it. Don't expect for you to come crawling back to them. You know, asking them, what can you do? No, 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 no. They need to show that they want it as well, okay? Let's see what the potential outcome is. Mm. Let's see what we got here. We have the Five of Cups having regrets. Nine of Cups is like doing things in excess. Wish fulfillment, but with the Five of Cups, I, well, I would have to say this is like drinking because somebody's feeling really regretful here. Um, you know, all in their head because they do want to reunite. They do want to reunite. They really do. But let's go ahead and pull some cards out the deck for you guys to see what the potential outcome is here. What's the potential outcome? Hmm. I think you will start, you know, focusing on yourself because we have this one cup with the page and then the eight, that's the nine of cups. And I feel like for you, you know, the right now, what you need to do, what you need to say is nothing. Focus on yourself. Focus on yourself. Um, open yourself up to other possibilities, okay? That's what I'm getting here. Let's see. For them. Look at that. This is your card, Sag. I feel like this person will eventually come towards you with an offer. What offer that is? Maybe it's a talk. Maybe it's to go out for a drink. But... It's something that they are going to, I feel, realize and it's going to spark something in them and then they're going to take the initiative, okay? I do feel like at some point this is going to happen. 
for you guys okay so my Sagittarius that is what I have for you guys and I will be speaking with you soon bye now